What up, y'all? Good morning, man. It's your boy, Chance, back with a brand new live stream. Like I said, good morning, guys. If you guys don't know um, what's going on, why everything seems wider, that is because I actually am using my brand new super wide lens on this because I it, it seems wider it seems better like, it's wider it's a lot better and easier to use freaking love it um also last night my album evolution did drop so be sure to give it a check out man the links where you guys can listen to it are in the description up above or wherever you guys see it But I just wanted to come on here, you know, kick it with y'all. You know how I do it in the mornings, and I love to kick it with you guys. But uh, I did do a review on the lenses um, for this morning. Um, that video will be up very shortly, actually. Um, this morning, I did get the chance to try out some of my lenses. I was very impressed with them. Uh, if you guys don't know, um, the company I am going through right now for my lenses, which I, this is in no way any kind of promo. This, I'm not going to take this, but I absolutely love this. I absolutely love these guys. I swear by them. And I've used other ones before, but they're not as good. So if you have like a mobile phone or anything like that, pick these guys up. Five Star Prime, 20 bucks on Amazon, which ain't bad at all. So instead of spending like hundreds of dollars on your know, high-end stuff, you can actually do quite a bit um, with the super wide lens, which I'm currently using on the camera. And these, you get like, and let me count it here, because you get the two on there, which is the macro lens and the super wide. Oh, uh, yeah, fisheye. You get telescopic. And, and four other lenses. Like, they're, they're all very good. Like, I highly recommend these guys. And I didn't get a red case, but that's cool. Like I do like black. I do like black cases anyway. But I did get this super cool um, gunmetal gray clean cloth for the lenses. You guys might get a different color, but be sure to check them out, dude. I definitely recommend these guys. And you don't have to be a pro, like photographer to be able to get good pics. Um, all you really need are a couple apps that I use personally, which are Lumio Cam and Camera MX, but I do use Camera MX 99.9% .9 of the time. Just because it's like it's got the super cool little extra effects that give me that little bit of an extra edge. So shout out to five star prime. Freaking love these guys. If you guys are into photography or shooting films and whatnot, which I will be shooting some film work very, very soon with these, be sure to give them a check out. What up, Garrett? What's going on, my dude? But also, with these, you actually do get a couple really cool things. Um, you actually get a card, which is basically your user manual. You know, basically tells you what lenses you get and it also kind of shows you on two different sides you know what lenses work with what which is super dope it kind of shows you like what lenses do work with each other and then you also get this which if you guys are in for it Um, but um, if you guys 
you know, do have any issues, you do get this, which is like, I call it a certificate, but it's basically a thank you note. So if you guys have any issues, like if you break a lens or like if like, let's say you lose a cap or whatever, or if you guys are having any issues, you guys can go right there. It's like a little thank you note, but you guys go to that email right there and email them and they will replace or help you out with whatever it is. They'll replace whatever part that needs replaced or whatever issue you guys might have. So that's super dope, and that comes in the box with this. So that's super dope. Um, like I said, if you guys check out my um, photography um, art profile and whatnot, like my photography and photography art pro, or not profile, but my photography and photography art portfolio, which I just updated this morning, um, I did use my phone. And went outside when it was like super early. It was like seven in the morning. Like it was just around like seven o'clock. So the sun was just starting to come up. And I managed to get some really nice pictures actually. Um, I will be shooting a lot of music videos with this. If you guys don't know, my internal mic on my Chromebook did break. So I am using the microphone, which is kind of laying over there. It's actually my gaming headset the microphone to that so i'm sorry guys where i won't be doing any more live streams without the headphones or my other microphone but preferably my headset mic because that does have clear quality but uh like i said guys if y'all do want to check out my album evolution both links to spotify and youtube are in the descriptions up above so y'all can peep those check them out you know give them a like share them around you know get other people jamming to that stuff if you guys do want to buy the album it's like only six dollars and something cents because it's a seven track album super dope um i definitely have fun putting it together for you guys and i hope you guys enjoy it too um i will be getting a tripod at the end of the month so you guys by the end of the month and by the end, by the end of this month and beginning of next month, you guys can expect some super, super cool and very unique music videos coming out. Sorry, guys, you got freaking fruit fly that likes to fly around my shit half the time. Dope, dude. That's what's up. I definitely can't wait to hear it. Um, if you guys don't know, me and my brother Eric Scrubwell, we are back to working together again full time. Yes, for those of you that are fans of everybody on Bloodshot Records, I am still co owner of Bloodshot Records. You know, Bloodshot Records will always be my home. That's, you know, where my brother Ian's at. That's where the guys I work with daily are at. Like, I am Bloodshot Records for life, dude. Like, I will rep Bloodshot Records till the day I'm dead. But me and Eric are starting back up. Kill a Clown Sounds for all you KKS fans out there that have been there since day one. Uh, we are starting that stuff back up and really digging back into the old sound you guys know and love us for. So you guys can definitely expect some really dope-ass music coming from me and Eric very soon i'm not sure exactly one but very soon it's coming and also let me know in the comments what you guys think about this wide the super wide lens like do you guys like that you guys like the regular camera because like i can do either one it don't matter which one i use I'm always down for doing new stuff. Help y'all want to use fish eye. I can use fish eye. I can use any lens you guys want. Right? The wide lens I do like because like you can actually see more. It's actually more you can actually see, you know, everything behind me. Like if, if you guys can't tell, like I'll actually show you guys the difference. Between the wide lens, like as you guys can tell right now, this is the wide, the super wide lens. And this is how it looks without it. 
you guys can't really see as much like a lot of this is blanked out but when I slap now adjust it here there we go but like when I slap on the wide lines you guys pretty much see everything behind me so like it's a major difference it's very good dude I absolutely love the wide lines I absolutely swear by five star prime um, I've not had any issues yet and a lot of people do have issues within the first 24 hours but I absolutely love five star prime so far they're very good like I said, I will be shooting some film work with it as well. I'm super excited to be doing that again. Um, the solo film that I was going to film the other day did get, you know, put off due to sound issues with my Kindle Fire. So I will be going back to using my regular phone to shoot the film. So I'm so looking forward to doing that. It's going to be super fun. Um, if you guys want to run down on the film, basically it's about this guy who, you know, he's basically, you know, around our age, you know, like, well, not our age, but like basically it's kind of centered around like this day and age, like with Facebook and all that. And, you know, like digital games and apps. Basically, this kid, you know, he's into, like, the occult. He's super into, like, the weird stuff. And he goes on to, you know, the app store, grabs up this Ouija board, and I'm just messing around. And, you know, he messes with it, you know, gets a little spooked, you know, kind of thing. So, you know, he closes out the game, you know, whatnot, and then he goes for a walk, you know, next day you know, down in the woods by his house, you know, just randomly walking, and he starts hearing things, you know, like here and there, you know, he really starts, you know, hearing voices, and what he doesn't realize is, like, the voices are actually the demons that he released when he messed with that Ouija board, so it's gonna be a super good movie, I'm really looking forward to filming it. Like I said, but that will be coming after the end of the month once I get the tripod so I can actually film scenes, you know, properly without having to, you know, constantly hold the camera, you know, kind of like at the side of me, in front of me, like this, like that. I can actually have it on a tripod and actually film the scenes properly. So that's going to be super cool. I'm looking forward to that. But, uh, yeah, you guys can definitely expect some new stuff coming soon. And if you guys do play Nitro Nation, um, the game for a mobile device, they did just bring out the new Porsche 918 Carrera, or the Porsche 918 um, car on there. So if you guys are into drag racing and you guys play Nitro Nation, catch me on there, Drift King Customs. Um, I do rock the door slammers for now so I can join my brothers, Ethan and Ricardo, on extreme speeds. Shout out to my brothers. Love you guys. You guys are fucking amazing. And I do want to say thank you to everybody that wished me a happy birthday yesterday. Shout out to my Uncle JJ. Love you, Uncle JJ. Shout out to just everybody in general. Um, I did get, you know, random... You know, like, have birthdays and stuff on other stuff as well. Like, you know, from our good friend of the family, um, Bo Bridges. You know, shout out to Bo for giving me a happy birthday. Love you, man. Can't wait to see your new films. I'm super excited for that. Um, shout out to everybody in Bo and Jeff Bridges' family, their daughters. Shout out to their cousin Kevin. What's up, Kevin? I'm seen you since I was a kid, man. And also, I do want to wish my best friend, my childhood best friend, Corey's sister, who's basically like my sister, Amber Shanahan, a very happy birthday. 
from yesterday. If you guys don't know, me and her share the same birthdays. So it's pretty cool. But I uh, have a birthday, Amber. I hope you had a good one. I know I had a great one. We went out to eat. Uh, went to a really nice little hole in the wall restaurant. So it was super fun. I had a good time there. Um, I actually got the one, I actually wound up meeting up with a couple fans that I actually know from the area around here, so that was super cool. You know, we hung out, had a good time, and just really took a day to kind of, you know, relax. You know, I didn't film anything, I didn't do any photos or anything, we just hung out, which I like to do that. Like, especially when, you know, when it's with family and, you know, really close fans of my work that, you know, that know what I'm about. You know, I don't always film my entire life. I don't always put my life out there. Some things I do like to keep private. Um, actually, another good example would be April 1st when, you know, my niece Ray Lynn was born. You know, we didn't film that or put that out there. That was a private moment. You know, just like me going out with my family and you know, meeting up with a couple of friends and fans of my work yesterday. That was a private thing. So I, I had a lot of fun, though. I did enjoy it. And I do thank you guys for, you know, the birthday wishes yesterday. You guys are fucking amazing. But if you guys are wondering what all I got for my birthday, um, as you guys know, I got this as an early birthday present. Rowdy Ronda Rousey Cup. Shout out to Ronda Rousey for actually liking my Instagram post about this cub. That was super cool. So shout out to Ronda. Shout out to everybody at WWE. Shout out to AJ Styles, Roman Reigns. Shout out to everybody on the Shield. Shout out to Allison. What up? But uh, yeah, for my birthday, like I said, obviously you guys already know about the Cub. That was an early birthday present. And then, you know, I got this, which are my lenses for my phone. Like I said, if you guys are just now joining the live stream, I am using the super wide lens on my Chromebook. That's why you guys see more than what you normally see. Normally, it's just like this. Well, you know, it's like normal like this, but now it's like you see everything which i may use it more often and then at the end of the month i am getting the tripod which i'm super looking forward to because i really am looking forward to that tripod so i can actually do more stuff i mean i could do a lot already but the tripod and these lenses they make all the difference for a lot of stuff Hey, thanks, Allison. You freaking rock. And if you guys don't know and you guys are just now joining the live stream and you did not catch last night's live stream, my brand new seven track album, Evolution, dropped last night on the Spotify, on YouTube, Google Play Store, iTunes, and it was on everywhere where you guys usually check out your music. If you guys want to buy the album, it's like only six dollars and something cents on Amazon and iTunes. Or if you don't have money, you guys can stream it on YouTube, um, Spotify, anywhere where you guys, you know, listen to your music, you guys can stream it on there. So be sure to check it out and let me know what you think. I did add the new genre of music on there, and I do have a contest for you guys centered around that. What I want you guys to do, and here's the contest. You guys can win a military-based poster, a sticker pack, and a couple other things as well. But what I want you guys to do, if you've not already checked out the album, I want you to go there after this live stream, listen to the album. And here's the thing. I want you guys to pick out because I did add it, I did release a brand new genre into the album. Like a brand new genre that I made completely myself. It's just now getting out there. But here's my challenge to you guys. I want you guys to pick out what songs you guys think is the brand new genre that I created. 
off the entire album. I want you guys to pick out what songs you think are the brand new genre based songs. And if you guys get them right, you guys can win either a poster, sticker packs, um, maybe even possibly a VIP access pass for the Shadow Blade Fan Club, which will give you access to basically everything early ahead of time. You guys will be the first ones to get everything when it first comes out. You guys will get some really cool wallpapers and everything like that. So be sure to go check out the album and pick out which songs you guys think they are. And like I said, if you guys do win, you guys guess it right. You guys will win some really cool stuff. And yeah, I do hope you guys do like <clears throat> Pardon me. I do hope that you guys do enjoy the album. I had a lot of fun making it. Um, I do have a classical violin album coming out very soon. Because as you guys know, I'm very big into classical work. Um, I love, you know, playing piano, violin, you know, stuff like that on, you know, PC-based keyboards. So I'm going to have a great time doing that. I'm very much looking forward to that. Yo, shout out to Viker. What is up, my dude? But, uh, yeah, other than that, guys, today's just kind of a, you know, chill day. You know, I might watch some NASCAR because I know NASCAR season is about to end real soon. Like, not very soon, but, like, it's getting to that point to the end of the season. So, I'm probably going to end up chilling out, watch some NASCAR racing, watch some IndyCar racing. You know, catch up on a little bit of some new anime that is out that I've been dying to see. Uh, but like I said, guys, I do have big plans for the end of the month as far as filming goes, as far as photography goes. I have some big things planned. I have some big things coming up for you guys. But uh, yeah, like I said, I hope you guys do enjoy the music that I put out. I hope you guys enjoy the album Evolution. And I do have a new hit single dropping on Monday. So that's going to be awesome. It's not an album. It's actually a regular song. It's not an album. So be sure to check that out. And I will see you guys later on, man. I hope you guys do have a great day, man. And I will definitely catch you guys throughout the day. So with that being said, love every single one of you guys. Thank you guys for their birthday wishes. Every single one of you. I did read them all. I'm currently going back and responding to all of them as we speak. I'm going back. I'm going to be going back through and responding because I got so many yesterday. I was hard to keep up. But thank you guys for the birthday wishes. I read every single one of them. Absolutely love you guys. You guys are amazing. You guys are awesome. And I'll see you guys later, man. Peace.